Good afternoon everybody, welcome to another workout for this week. Like we did in previous weeks, we're discussing compound movements. And this week we'll be doing an overhead press or a shoulder press, military press, whatever you want to call it. Getting the bar right over our head, that's the main thing. Good exercise to isolate the, the delts and really strengthen your shoulder muscles and work in your core as well while doing the exercise. This is Eugene, a pretty good friend of mine. This is all real you. muscle. <laughs> We're going to do, he's going to show us the exercise now. Main thing is, he's going to step in from behind. The bar is set up prior to two lifting at about just a little bit higher than chest height. So we'll walk in from behind, come in, we'll have the bar almost right on top of his chest, shoulder height, arms just a little bit wider than shoulder width as you can see. From there he's going to lift it up slightly, let it rest on his chest, and from there step back. Good position, he's bending his knees a little bit. From there he'll press right over his head, extend at the top, locking up, chest out a little bit, from there lowering down, right to his chest again. So it's up, lock up, slowly down, pause at the bottom, right on his chest, and hand again. Up, locking up, slowly down. From there to safely put it back, you walk in, and just hook it onto the power rack. Now this exercise is really nice, especially if you can use a power rack or a squat rack, really just to make sure that you can handle the exercise and the weight safely. That's the main thing for us. Um, you can also, if you're struggling with a little bit of back issues, you can either put your one foot in front of the other one, try not to lean back too much, that's the main thing. You want to always be safe. Keep your neutral spine throughout, you need to just push your chest out and then extend at the top. A nice exercise to do as well is a seated military press or shoulder press. You can do it on a rack, sitting down, using dumbbells, just sitting down, having some back support. Very good exercise, you can maybe go onto YouTube and, and, and Google it as well, some nice exercises, numb shoulder, nice shoulder variations you can use in your program. But yeah, try and see what it's all about. Use those compound movements and really see how you, the strength can increase. Hope you enjoy it, have some fun while training and learning. Have a good week, all the best. Bye.